It's time for an early look ahead at the Netflix originals currently planned to hit the service throughout the month of July 2023. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel. They clone Tyrone, 2023. A pulpy, sci-fi mystery caper in which an unlikely trio investigates a series of eerie events, alerting them to a nefarious conspiracy lurking directly beneath their hood. Fontaine, a neighborhood drug dealer, is shot dead by rival Isaac and then is very shocked to wake up in his bed the next morning unharmed. He and Slick Charles and Yo-Yo begin looking into the incident, and their search eventually leads them to a vast underground complex where a government-backed lab is performing experiments on the local black population. Realizing that he is an artificial clone controlled by Nixon, Fontaine initially feels despair, but decides he needs to stand up to these white institutional overlords for the sake of his neighborhood. If you thought meeting your spouse's parents for the first time might make you anxious and raise your blood pressure, then you have got to meet Owen Browning and his would-be in-laws. The Outlaws, 2023, is Netflix's latest action comedy film, starring Adam Devine as Owen, a security officer at a bank who tries his best to win over his fiancé's parents, whom he meets for the first time at the wedding. But when his bank gets robbed, Owen suspects that the robbers might be his future in-laws and is about to have an experience of a lifetime filled with shocking revelations and mysteries. The crime comedy film is directed by Tyler Spindle and written by Evan Turner and Ben Zazo and is an Adam Sandler production for Netflix. Super Team 4 One of our most anticipated titles from Netflix's upcoming slate of animated series aimed toward younger audiences is Super Team 4. Four teen girls living in the neo-futuristic African city of Lusaka are recruited by a retired secret agent still committed to saving the world, even if it's on a budget. In their journey from schoolgirls tackling homework to undercover superheroes fending off supervillains, they're transformed from a motley crew of friends into Super Team 4. Happiness for Beginners For some, a post-divorce reset means getting a drastic new haircut. But in Happiness for Beginners, Helen deals with the end of her marriage in a more creative way by enrolling in a backcountry survival course hiking the Appalachian Trail. Written and directed by Vicki White, this adaptation of Catherine Center's novel of the same name follows Helen as she and her quirky group of fellow hikers test themselves against nature. As it turns out, though, bear traps and blisters might be easier to deal with than the arrival of handsome newcomer Jake. Will Helen find more than mosquitoes in the wilderness? I'll never get over how cute they look for monsters. And they're like, no, please don't hurt me. And then, wow! Fangs. Just like a boatload of fangs. All up in your business. But it'll certainly help in keeping you alive. In 1982, the best of friends and still teenagers George Michael and Andrew Ridgely as Wham! set out to conquer the world. By June of 1986, they played their very last gig at Wembley Stadium having done exactly that. Now for the very first time, told in their own words, 
the amazing story of how in four years they dominated the charts around the world with timeless and classic pop songs. Hit after hit Club Tropicana, Wake Me Up Before You Go Go, Freedom, I'm Your Man and of course Last Christmas. Their time in the spotlight was white hot, becoming the very first Western pop act to play in China. It was a time that both encapsulated and epitomized not just their youth, but also those of the many millions of fans that adored them.